A few weeks ago, I had the unique opportunity to experience driving the Elizabeth Line Driver Training Simulator. I won this experience as a prize in the 2023 Railway Family Charity Prize Draw, so huge thanks to MTR Elizabeth Line and the Railway Family for this incredible opportunity. We had an Elizabeth Line Driver Instructor with us for the day, operating the simulator and teaching us about real-world scenarios and problems which can occur. Overall, this experience really went beyond my expectations, and I can't thank them enough. You join the action here with me getting introduced to the simulator for our first journey of the day, from London Paddington High Level to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately, I want to be the signaler. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you want to come along with me? I'm trying to work. I'll come have a look okay. at your, your signaling. So... <laughs> Yeah. If you make a mistake, it's the same. We hit to, to fail. No, okay? of course. So, so, first so what I will do also is be as an instructor. Mm -hmm. I will be telling you the speeds, so how fast you can go, and then you do experience. And breaking Wait. points. And breaking points. <laughs> um, I will explain a bit more from the speaker. Okay. So I'm over there. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to hear some. Nice. Okay. okay? Very nice. Okay. Let's see that. 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 How do you guys know all this stuff? Train simulator. We're trained. I played train 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 simulator when I was a kid. Oh, triple clef, base clef. Yeah, the oh, they have done some. I've seen it on the 700s as well. That's so cute. I, I know, it's a nice little detail. Be, so not only can you deafen people, you can deafen it with some of these called accoutrements. With harmony, yes. Mm hmm. Wait, what? You can change the pitch of the whistle? Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, treble, bass. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh, I wasn't, no. wasn't pulling it hard enough. Are they just waiting for you to go? I don't know. No. Oh. Okay. We're gonna find out in a minute. Just yeah. shouting at you. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> so right now, the speed you are leaving the station. Stations normally no more than 15 miles an hour because then, so you still have passengers could be hanging. You've got points set in front of you, and those points are... This is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. 25 miles an hour. So yes, just station, 20, at the The line. maximum is 20 miles an hour now. Makes sense, yeah. Whoa, well, that accelerates quickly. <laughs> yeah, it's, they are very efficient, lightweight trains. So you saw your 40 that come in there. Mm -hmm. Remember, every time there's a speed change, the rear of the, the train has to pass that speed for you to start increasing your speed. So right now we're still on 20 miles an hour. This is how we teach drivers here is, can you tell what signal is yours? It's very rare, it's very difficult, isn't it? And this is what happened in Glasgow incident. So what we tell drivers to do is to actually what we tell drivers to do. So if you look at from left to right and you start counting, so you're in line four now. If you start telling, if you start counting from left to right, so one, two, three, four, so you know exactly what, which one is your signal and you cannot read across. Yeah. I see, and you got the signs above the signals. Correct, because this signal is known for being spiked several times, for example. It's very difficult.
minutes the three um, signaling systems. So now the next signal is your first four aspect signaling. check your signal because mm -hmm. you don't know the signaler they might have put you a red signal mm. okay so green signal so closed. yeah whenever you want take power up to 70 miles an hour with next stop is um Ealing Broadway mm. and the screen stay on after you so this top. is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4 next station Ealing Broadway Change for Central District National Rail Services. Uh, so, 
see your signals time is red, so I need to start slowing down. Is that the minute? You've got a station coming in. is a red is not a station so you prioritize what's more important for us it's a red once you come to a stand then you forget of the red and you open the doors to lift it if you're trying to get it up. Ah. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, just being held at a red signal should be on the move shortly. Oh, I think he's got a call from the signaler there. Oh. Wait. Yeah. I think you have to hold that. Hello. <laughs> There's no, like, I don't know, maybe, does that just mean it's in contact with the signal. Hmm. So have you got a message from the signal app? I think so. Okay, so pick up the radio. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So now it's connected. So he's going to speak to you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hello, driver 2 Tango 55. Uh, hello, this is a call from the signal at Thames Valley Signaling Centre uh, to the driver of 2 Tango 55. Please respond. Uh, two, driver 2 Tango 55 five, receiving. Hello, driver 2 Tango 55. Five. Um, unfortunately, uh, I need to let you know that signal Sierra November 209 ahead has uh, failed. So, when I authorize you to do so, I will require you to pass Sierra November 209 at danger. Can you please repeat this back to me? Uh, understand, bound, authorized uh, to pass. Uh, Sierra November 209 at danger when you give the old word. Uh, yeah, that's correct. Um, so, yeah, as I said, unfortunately it has uh, failed. Um, the movement is to proceed, well, you'll be clear to proceed as far as the next signal. There's no infrastructure involved to worry about. I will require you to proceed at caution until you reach the following signal, which is Sierra November 211. Uh, please repeat that back. Okay, understand. I'll pass Sierra November 209. Uh, proceed at caution as far as the next signal. Uh, yep, yeah, that's correct, driver. So um, I'm now happy to authorise you to pass Sierra November 209 at danger. What you need to do is, because you only have a time from here, so when you, um, when you um, press the button, you need to draw forward. So you now 
Draw forward to the signal and then that's when you press the button. Evening Broadway. This is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. West Ealing, change for National Rail Services. Yellow Good box. <laughs> Almost as bad. So the line speed in here is 90 miles an hour, okay? Uh, I'm proceeding at caution. Alright, so it's down to you what speed you can do, but your next station is um, West Ealing, so it's down to you how fast you go. Mm. Okay, fine, yeah. It's ending. I'm guessing once we get the AWS ding from the next signal, I'm okay to stop proceeding at caution. Yeah, but this one you use is on, so next signal is green. Mm -hmm. The last signal, it only remembers what the last oh, I see. input was. Okay. Now I'm proceeding just on the authority of the signals. Next station, West Ealing. Waitrose. <laughs> We've actually got the logo in here.
my body still creates inertia for me when this thing stops. <laughs> I feel like I should be lurched forward and I hate it. It's sort of like reverse seasickness, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It is. It's horrible. It's like walking at the end of an escalator that isn't moving. You still feel like you're being thrown off it. What are they doing? You can still get on. I don't like the look of those two. <laughs> but they don't want to get on, apparently. Perhaps they don't want to go to Heathrow. Yeah. Which says, get away from the yellow line. Actually, they're way too close. <laughs> this is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. Next station, Hamwell. Hamwell, I can see it already. Okay. Certain stations you can see just from the edge of one platform. Oh, no, that's it. It's this sort of yellowy canopy just past the signal. Oh, man, this accelerates quickly. <laughs> Adventurous, lightweight, AC drive. Take off like the proverbial off a shovel. I think it's probably ASDO, or it might be a different technology, something like that. There's, um, yeah, like beacons in the track that tell the train where it is. Mm. Right. It's tricky cameras here, you can't see that much. Um, Obscured by stupid historical architecture. Yeah. <laughs> stupid listed building. <laughs> Who needs listed buildings? This is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. Next station, Southall. You've also got CCTV there on your left. Yeah. See all the tourists going to and from Heathrow. It's not safe here. Please stay where you are. We'll be in a south hall in a moment. <sighs> Drivers. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't need 
tigres and you didn't notice. How is that? Yep. How you reset it is here in the back. Okay? Oh. So PEA, PEA, CFA. So that is the PEA. So how we reset it is we press it. Oh. But you also had an egress, you didn't notice I pressed it. So I pressed this to ignore Yeah, the but that is um, when but it goes to a stage two. Mm. That's a completely different because we didn't acknowledge that's why I went to the egress. Oh, I see. Oh, I so, an so egress this, this and you had the season. image, but I think you were talking and you didn't notice. I said, let's see if he noticed when he gets to the station. But I thought, you know what, let me do something real. Yeah. Which is, driver, I want to get out, I didn't get out. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I saw the CCTV pop up. But I so how know. we react in one and in another is completely different. How we react, we have two stages with mm. the egress. We have a stage one, where a child can actually pull it, mm. and nothing happened, the image will just come up. Mm. You and your Continue. fire. <laughs> you just continue driving, that's not a problem. Mm. If he then press it again and go to stage two, when you go below one mile an hour, the black sensors will be able to open. So you basically, you're taking the air out of the door, and once it goes below one, you can just open the door. Mm. And then you have the emergency one, the main you see how you have to be able to get it straight away. Or if you try to make a PA and all that, mm. and um, they keep on and on and on, you will have to stop. Okay? Mm. Yes, well, so, the only way that orange now will come out is when you um, reset the door. So, once you open and close them, that bolt will go off. Or was it just somewhere on the screen that it needed to acknowledge the. No, stage no, no, one? no, no. It's because I did a stage one. Mm -hmm. So, it's only when you now cycle the door. So, when you open them and close them, that will come off. Mm -hmm. Oh, well done, well done. <laughs> <laughs> the important thing is staying calm and staying composed. Yeah. I'm so confused. Egress is when you pull the emergency door open. Yeah. What was it you were supposed to do? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's just, that was just me. That's Next fine. Station, to see the passengers. <laughs> yeah. Reject signal SN 253. Southall, this is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. for a bit, I can record it for about 25 minutes. Yeah, yeah right. fair enough. <laughs> so the door, that one door is still orange, mm. and then maybe when I close it... it should, I think she mentioned about cycling the door, so I think it'll probably reset it. Mm. We've got the late runners. Yeah. You can hardly see the front of the train on these cameras. Mm. Right. I also see a stopped counter there as well that I quite like. Oh yeah. Oh, it's still orange. Hmm. Okay. Back to CCTV view again. This is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. Next. Next station, Hayes and Harlington. Change for National Rail Services.
Alright, still no movement authority. <laughs> to run we're not going anywhere. <laughs> not yet. No. If that's a flight you're in, that's a flight. <laughs> you've got to save your energy. Ah. Got to save your energy for catching the flight. Now we have movement authority. Yep. And towards one clear. Okay. Signal's clear and speed is twenty five. Oh. Ah yes. Don't that's forget the DR rate. <laughs> Driver reminders and lines. Yeah. You always have to use it. This is the train to Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. Next station, Heathrow Airport Terminal 4. So if the signal isn't green, so you say if it's. Sorry, now you know how it works with the screen, so I'm going to let you drive it because in front of you you've got the speeds, okay? Mm -hmm. So yeah, essentially if it's not green, so if it's yellow, double yellow, or red, even if you stop at a station or anywhere, always set your DRA because chance side, you stop at a station and it's green, but then they set it back to red. I see what you're saying. If you do that, the DTM, your manager, will put you into a coffee, as we call it, TM coffee. You only use the DRA for when you have a red. That's if, if you misuse it, then you can have an incident because of that. Okay, so understood. So only when it's red. Only when it's red. If you red. have it down low, the managers will put you into the office. Right, understood. <laughs> you can have free, free biscuits and free tea if you want to. <laughs> I'd much rather be 100% assured. It's a sweet biscuit. So here we are in Heathrow Terminal 4. If you've watched this far, I hope you've enjoyed this video and learned something. I certainly learned a lot from the experience. 
Later in the day we took turns driving, the others experienced driving through the core section under the CBTC signaling system, which has its own rules compared to the TPWS and ETCS sections which I experienced. Thanks again to NTR Elizabeth Line and the Railway family for this amazing experience. I'd also like to give a shout out to Ian Visits on Facebook, as it was thanks to him that I found out about the prize draw. So, if you have been, thank you for watching. Okay. All right. I don't like. Actually, I need to shut down. Oh, I think the door's still running. Oh, I'm not so sure. What I don't understand. You probably need it. If you're in the tunnel. Yeah. Why not? Obviously, it's dark. Do you like? Do you like the room? <laughs> well. So let me just stop it. And shall we drive now back to Paddington, or who would you like to drive to? Yeah. Yeah. Who, who wants to go? I'm, I'm okay. okay. I, I mean, I feel like I'm not deserving of this because I actually don't know what to have. Does anybody want a drink? Tea, coffee? I got tea, yeah. coffee. Yeah. Let's let's go for a quick tea break before we uh, refresh ourselves. At least not tea in this case. Yeah. <laughs>